Janelle York here, your vegan punk pinup, with a special unscheduled episode of York and Spoon today. So you may be wondering why I'm dressed like the American flag, and I'm going to tell you in just a second, but first, I want to remind you, if you haven't watched my last video for Sunshine Juice, there's a giveaway going on when I reach 100 subscribers. I think we're just seven away, so make sure to watch that video and see how you can enter to win and do so. So we're going to start by making a coconut whipped cream today, and this outfit is because I'm going to the Katy Perry concert tonight. So I was inspired by her to make something really whimsical, and this is what I'm wearing. I'm wearing this in public. <laughs> so let's get started. So you may have seen recently, I think just this week, So Delicious released a coconut whipped cream or Cool Whip in a container, and people are very excited about that, as am I but I haven't had the chance to try it yet. So I want to show you how simple it is to make your own coconut whipped cream if you can't find that in stores or you want to try to make something homemade. So really it's two ingredients and I'm going to add a little bit of sprinkles for mine for Katy Perry flair today. But you'll need a bowl and I put this in the freezer for about 20 minutes before making this recipe today. You'll need some powdered sugar, some coconut milk, and some strawberries or whatever you would like to dip in your whipped cream. So we've got one can of coconut milk here. You wanna make sure that you get full fat, not the light for this, because what we want is to use just the fatty part. So I put this in the fridge ideally overnight. So you're just gonna scoop off the thick white cream that rises to the top. Now, I may have a little trouble today because I did read that if your coconut milk contains orgum, it's meant to keep things from separating and will do so for you. So I didn't get much full fat cream at the top, so we'll see how this does. But it might be more like a dipping sauce than a whipped cream for us today. So make sure if you're getting full fat whipped cream, you look for it without gorgum. But you're gonna add that into your bowl, your chilled bowl, and then just a little bit of powdered sugar. So just to sweeten this up, I'm gonna add about one tablespoon and we're gonna whip this together with an electric beater. I'm gonna start on low. And this should thicken up and become a little bit of a whip consistency. You just wanna do that until it's nice and fluffy and your sugar's mixed in. Now, as I thought, mine's not gonna be that pretty. It's gonna be more like a dipping sauce than a whip, but that's okay. All right. So as I said, since I was inspired, inspired to do something whimsical today for the Katy Perry concert, I'm gonna sprinkle mine with sprinkles on top. Some very brightly colored star sprinkles. And I'm gonna serve that alongside some strawberries today. So let me know in the comments below what your favorite thing to dip in whipped cream is. Don't say yourself. And give it a thumbs up if you like this video. Make sure to check out my other videos as well. Thank you.